Well, how are you doing? Jerry Wilson here. I'm going to take us back to 1981. I played drums in a four-piece group out in Sun Valley. It's called Circeco Restaurant and Dance Club. Yeah, we had a pretty good sounding swing type band. And uh, I sang with the drums. And our first sax player was Hal, uh, what is it? Hal Infinity Q50. That's his name. Uh, he was born with that name. That's before the car came out. He stayed with us for three months and then he took off to go on an ocean cruise. So we had to like really s scurry around and replace him with somebody. And wouldn't you believe it, we came up with another Hal, but a different last name, of course. The guy we came up with was Hal Sasquatch. And uh, wow, he was six foot eight and he wore size 18G shoes. Wow, and when he came into the club the first night, the place completely was shocked, you know? I have a guest back here. She just made some noise. Don't show yourself, honey. Keep yourself hidden. Hidden. Okay, I'm going to bring her on in a couple of minutes. It's supposed to be a surprise. Anyway, uh, Sasquatch's favorite tunes to play was Canadian Sunset, Trees, which is I think I'll never see a poem lovely as a tree, and the big bongo, 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 I don't want to leave the Congo. Civilization. He loved playing that, and that was his real hot number. And uh, he did really well for us. They liked him a lot. And he had another month left before we were almost about to lose him. Uh, and what I did, I waited and waited for his wife to come into town because she wanted to come into the club. And sure enough, she walked in one day on a Saturday night, and her name is Sheena Sasquatch. And she, uh, is six foot two, that's tall for any woman, and with heels, she's six foot eight. And her shoe size with regular shoes is 16 G. So uh, she had the high numbers too. You might say she was way up there, you know. And uh, how did it go from there? Sasquatch kept playing and playing and playing. And one night somebody in the audience said, let's hear Sheena sing a song. So I brought her up on stage and she went into an old swinger, and it's very fitting. It's called, I'm Sitting on the Top of the World. And all that was really great. And then it came the time and the day for them to go out, go back up north to the wooded area up north in the snow. And so they left us on that last night where she sang, I'm Sitting on Top of the World. And as far as popular requests goes, uh, Hal Sasquatch got a re request to repeat uh, bongo, 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 I don't want to leave the Congo, oh no, 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 no. And he did it and they loved it, that was his farewell number. But they're back in town now, in Los Angeles right now, and they're shopping right now, the big shopping stores, and they brought their daughter, who is now in her 20s. She's a tall girl too. And that's who was peeking around my shoulder a minute ago. Sheena, not Sheena, Barbarella Sasquatch. Uh, Barbarella, you want to squeeze up and get into yeah. the frame? Can you oh, yeah. come a little closer to me? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. I'm babysitting uh, Barbarella. Mm -hmm. oh, you can't tell her, but she's 5'9". Yeah. The whole family is tall. What size shoe do you wear? Like a five and a half. Five and a half, you got a small foot. What yeah. happened? Well, what do you know? Anyway, that's the story mm -hmm. of Sir Seiko in 1981. Say good night to the people. Good night. And your, people. your folks will be here in a few minutes. Mm -hmm. Anyway, she's in good hands. Oh, good. Thank mm -hmm. you so much. Bye-bye.